And welcome back. Green Bay is going to, to look a whole lot greener this weekend as we celebrate St. Patrick's Day on Sunday. And if you want to get in the Irish spirit, you have as much luck as a four-wheelie flubber. Ooh, how about that? And joining us now to talk about the parade on Sunday is Tim O'Connor. He's the Sam Rock Club of Green Bay's Irish Person of the Year. And Mary Jones is here with her two wolfhounds. We have James and the other one's name again? Hadrian. Hadrian. These pooches, we're going to meet them in a bit. And Teresa Sinkler, she's the president of the Shamrock Club of Northeast Wisconsin. Guys, you're in your green all decked out for St. Patrick's Day. And uh, Teresa, this is coming up on Sunday, the parade. This is going to be a lot of fun. Tell us what's happening. Hey, it's downtown City Deck, um, 10 o'clock in the morning, Sunday. All right, very cool. And so we're going to be able to see these guys in the parade too, right? They're so huge. <laughs> Mary, tell us about your uh, friends here. Irish wolfhounds, these guys are big boys, but they're very lovable guys, and they love the parade, right? Gentle giants, and they love walking in the parade. They love seeing all the kids and the people that love to pet them. <laughs> now, you're the Irish person of the year. Tell us what that means exactly. Uh, being Irish person of the year just means that I'm uh, supporting Irish uh, culture and uh, helping with the club uh, festivities. It's uh, quite an honor and I'm very humbled um, in this group. We have excellent people in this club, great leadership. Everybody does a great job. They work hard, they play hard, and they just inspired me to do what I could to help. Now, Tim, uh, how do you earn the respect and the privilege to be the Irish person of the year. What'd you do to receive that? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm very, again, I'm very uh, humbled and I know some wonderful people in this club uh, that are inspiring and um, help me uh, do what we need to do to keep the club moving forward and uh, put on a good parade for the city of Green Bay. So tell us about exactly what we can expect in the parade. What will people be seeing? Oh. <laughs> They'll be seeing um, the Wolfhounds. They'll be seeing the 501, um, um, the, the Star Wars Brigade, and we will um, we'll see the mayor. Yeah, <laughs> probably mayor. for the last time. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of fun. There's gonna be music. There's gonna be drinks. There's gonna be food. Uh, these guys are gonna be in the parade too. Mary, how long have you been taking part in the parade with uh, these guys? This will be my third year. Third year, and right. the reaction that you get, because, I mean, the kids, when they see these things, I mean, these guys are almost as big as Shelly Bowtie. <laughs> so I gotta imagine when uh, they go through, people's faces light up, right? Oh, yes. Everybody loves them. Everybody wants to come and pet them. Yeah, it's a lot okay. of fun. And uh, again, everyone, this is coming up on Sunday. It's the St. Patrick's Day Parade. It's hosted by the Shamrock Club of Green Bay. Begins at 10 a.m. at the city deck. You can expect, as I mentioned, music, drinks, food, a lot of fun, some Irish Wolfhounds, 10 Irish Person of the Year. Yeah, lots of green out there, too. What a great way to celebrate St. Patrick's Day with a parade. So come on down, and it's free. And it's free. So go enjoy it, everyone. And uh, got to check in the forecast coming up on Local 5 this morning.